Hello, gents. We are back with episode two of Let's Play uh, Elder Scrolls Blade. So, we are continuing from where we la uh, left last time. Oh, a message. Welcome to Early Access. Oh, cool. So we can give feedback. Oh, I have a couple of, uh, of items in mind. Uh, so I'll be doing that a bit later. For now, let's head over into town and as you guys casted a vote uh, added your own options for the town's name we will go with Fort Jika let's uh, write this up uh, no not Vika what the hell am I doing uh, let's let's add a space between Fort and Jika that'll be great so we have our town we have the town's name let's do some crazy stuff <laughs> Let's see what uh, Junius has for us next. Okay, so we're trying to get more people back in, in, in the town. What to do next? Well... What can we build next? So we've rescued the blacksmith. And I'm th I think that the next step would be to uh, build his um, workplace, a smithy. So let's uh, let's see what uh, what else can we do? Like uh, missions, quests. Come on, man, speak with me. Okay. How can we find more materials? Didn't I select that? No, misclicked. Woodcutters in the Woodhaven Forest to the west. Okay, so they are missing. Not necessarily missing, but uh, out of contact. Well, I think I can help. And maybe I can get some supplies to rebuild some more stuff. Varro and Jaina Matthews. So these are the woodcutters. Husband and wife that we're trying to find. So here's Lond. Let's talk to him a bit. Maybe we can find out more. Why he went missing or something. Okay, so... Okay. Much better at crafting uh, swords and wielding them. Find out about another character, Henrik Seven Swords. Arena. Oh, this must be the arena that we see locked currently in game. Uh, help you rebuild your smithy. I will, just for good time's sake, I will rebuild uh, the smithy uh, right behind him. Because um, he's a nice guy. Look at his mustache. Look at his mustache. Look at him. <laughs> Mustachio. Si, por favor, trabaja, señor. Come on. Uh... Who are you? Sabina Clovia. I'm so sorry I didn't catch your name. Uh, nice to meet you. What can I do for me? Well, uh, lots of things that you can do for me. So she helps to become a great conjurer. Oh, that, that's a burn. All she can conjure now is disappointment. <laughs> oh, the, the dialogue is, uh, is littered with uh, salty responses and, uh, and funny things. <laughs> Let's see what missions we have. So we received Lumber Run. Meet the old Blade Master from Lond. Uh, oh, wow. Look at that difficulty <laughs> level. Uh, we've got rebuilding the blacksmith, but we need to do the lumber uh, run first to get lumber. To actually be able uh, to, uh, to, to rebuild it. We have no more materials. That damn town hall used up all our crap. Uh, let's equip, because I remember we had some boots from the last episode. Yep, let's put them on. Cheeky. <laughs> Not really 
uh, fashionable, but it'll have to. It'll, it'll have to suffice. We're quite handsome. So let's set out and search for uh, Matthews and, and Jenna, I believe they were. Uh, is there supposed to be a secret here? I remember, I remember from the uh, from the mission menu that yeah, it was. Uh oh, wolves! Ouch! Oh, these ones are like skeevers. Oh damn it! Whoop to the head! <laughs> Easy as a hunting a red skeever in the snow. Uh, okay, no more enemies around here. Uh, another wolf. Let's hit him. Bam! You got wrecked, son. Right in the McNuggets. <laughs> uh, there's no lumber around here. I'm looking for interactable content. What's that? <gasps> it's a Spriggan! Uh, it's a... A live tree of some sort. Spirit of the forest. And it's hitting me quite hard. Damn it, how can you block with your hands? Figures. It's a beast, or not actually a beast. It's a Spriggan. It doesn't require a shield. His flesh is shield. It's like a wooden shield. Get it? <laughs> Let's uh, add more to stamina. Oh, we received some gems. So on our next level up, we will go with... I can't upgrade quick strikes. Oh, it requires level 4. I'm at level 3. Power attack. I, I don't know. No, I won't pick this one. Let's see perks. I've got Armsman. And uh, on the left side tree we had elemental protections. That's four damage with versatile weapons. That's exactly what we uh, as a Nord have trade for. Uh, I believe it's uh, plus five damage from versatile weapons such as the battle axe, the great sword and uh, I believe uh, blunt weapons like maces and uh, and hammers, war hammers, war hammers. Yeah, let's let's quickly confirm. Let's go to stats. Five damage with great swords, battle axes, and war hammers. War hammers. Iron mace is that? Is the iron mace a war hammer? I don't think so. But it's a versatile weapon indeed. Yes, I'm going with Armsman. That should give us some extra damage. Uh, what's that? Oh, it's a plant. Nice. So there are also plants as pickables. Uh... Let's crack this. Oh, more lumber. Ah, I'll take that any time. There's more lumber here. And I think we triggered by the sound. Yeah, combat with this wolf. Bam! <laughs> Didn't see this coming, eh? <laughs> uh, I'm looking for our secret. Don't know where it is. Uh oh, Spriggan! Yeah, we blocked and stunned. Aha! Missed again. Ouch. Bow, bow, bow. And we're gonna hit. Aha! Stunned again. Combat feels actually great. Ouch. He did. <laughs> uh, let's see what's it. What's, what's that shining over there? <gasps> oh, we've just. Stumbled upon the secret! Yeah, stumbled upon the secret. Let's see what we can find here. Let's crack this open. More wood and gold. Mm. 
can't pass through here. Or under. Looks like, uh, yeah, collision. Invisible walls. That's mostly what devs do uh, from the art department. Oh, that, that was food. Okay. Didn't see it glowing at all. So that's what the devs in the art department do. They put up invisible walls when they want you to prevent uh, when they want to prevent you from uh, from reaching certain areas. And going right under the house, wooden chest. Going right under the house is not uh, something that you want to do in particular, unless you're out looking for bugs. <laughs> Let's see what the wooden chests got us. Open sesame. Ingots and some whatever. Limestone. Oh, we've we've uh, we've found Varro Matthias, the woodcutter. Oh, I'll save your wife. The Spriggans usually leave you alone. So now they've gone mad. Uh, I think we yeah we received an axe uh, to chop the spriggans, but the axe is uh, pretty dull on damage. My fine iron mace is much better. More wood. There's a spriggan. Most enemies have weaknesses against certain types of damage. Oh, I see, so... So there's like cutting, blunt damage. And uh, I don't know what else. Elemental, fire. So the type of weapon does matter in some cases. Ah, oh, it missed. What the hell did I miss? Is two pelts uh, with pelts, uh, as I've read on uh, uh, so far in the um, in the help center, has quite a lot of information. With pelts, you can actually craft uh, hide armors made out of leather, and leather has a leather. Um, Leather armor, in general, has a special uh, a perk. You have increased uh, stamina regeneration. But offers little protection. Another wolf. Bam! <laughs> Sleep tight. He was trying to sleep and I helped him. <laughs> uh, nothing here. Uh, what the hell am I looking at uh, for? We already found the secret. I don't know, maybe maybe another chest, maybe some... Whatever lumber we can find, or salt, or clay, or limestone. Ouch. I'm curious to, uh, to find out exactly how can you perform um, critical damage. Is it you have to release uh, at a specific point, right when it charges? I don't know. Yeah, I've already saved your husband. Our lumber is yours. She just gave it to me like that. <laughs> well, I'll take it. Let's explore some more. We've got a chest and a random stash. That's the limestone. Come on, take it. That's it. And another chest. Let's unlock the wooden chest. Uh, nothing, nothing left to do here. So I'll just, uh, I'll just complete uh, the chest. We got two more stuff. Pelt and potion of minor stamina. I'll keep that silver for later. Let's uh, let's complete the quest.
Did I miss something here? No. It's all gone, it's all looted and scavenged. <laughs> oh, what's this? Challenges. Interesting to see why and we haven't been able to to complete those. I don't know. I don't know, probably we just uh received them. Guess this simple urn turned out to be more dangerous than expected, sure. Quick on my feet. Yeah, you should see me when I'm standing in my arms. Good day. Well, let's head over to Lond and see if we can rebuild his uh, smithy. Pick a good spot. I'll pick the spot right behind you, the one uh, where it used to be before. Dwelling. We've got some houses now too, because it requires completion of, uh, of the quest. Yeah, so we need to perform this uh, to complete the smithy. What's here? Who's this guy? Gaius Platorius. You have a name that you answer to? Uh, well, my name is Jika Forza. You can call me Madam. <laughs> uh, you don't really care how I am. Seriously. I've got to find ways that can find your way into your skull. Uh, at least we're getting a quest. Yeah, sure, why not? Kill the goblins, get the gold. Well, the blacksmith is complete. The goblin scourge. New quests. Uh, yeah. So we can't talk to him and let... <laughs> he just teleported inside his, uh, his crib there. <laughs> Can we click the smithy? Can we enter it? Nope. Let's see what the smithy has. Oh, so clicking on the smithy uh, icon will just open the uh, the building menu. Requires level two. Our town is still level one. Thank you so much. Please accept blah, blah, blah. Let me know if I can help with anything. Oh, postings on the board need a town hall. Yeah, the, I remember seeing a board, but it was uh, defunct, did nothing. Job board unlocked. Go to jobs, not now. Mm. So this means additional quests. The, the, which means more chests, more gold and more loot. Burn, pillage and plunder. Quests, we've got the Goblin Scourge and jobs. Oh, that's... what are those? Seven hours, two days. It's like, there must be some daily and weekly quests. We've also got challenges, I think we just unlocked them. Hmm. I guess I'll uh, see to, this, to these quests um, a bit later. They seem to be quite easy. The rewards consist of uh, some gold and mystery chest, meaning I think the meaning we can get a random wood, silver, or gold chest. It's a bit small. I just rebuilt the exact same structure that was there before. <laughs> How can you say that, Junius? I will smack you right in the face. Uh, we've got another quest to uh, to free some uh, some people, green cap bandits. So the bandits kidnapped some of our people. Rescue the townsfolk. Who can we speak to around here? Decoration. Oh, I think we can place trees and stuff. Hmm. Varro, come on, speak to me. Don't know what we've done without you. Well, 
you had to deal with friggins a lot? More dangerous than usual. Well, something must have stirred him. Uh, when the fire broke out... He was not in town, so he could, can't give us any more information. And he doesn't even have a story. Well, you're a boring man, Varumatius. Be gone! From my face. Before I feed you to the lions. What? Ask your wife. Is this her wife? No, that's... Horse mouth? Really a horse mouth? He doesn't even have a horse face. <laughs> ah, my mace can make you a horse face. <laughs> Any of my business? Ah. You're an arrogant lass, aren't you? I can make your desires come true. Hit you in the face with my mace. Yeah, that's a rhyme. If you talk to me like that ever again, I'll bitch slap you back to Bangkok. Who's this guy? Theodore Golash. Meet again. Are you not glad to find that we are in the same place at the same time? We haven't, we have not? What? See, think about this possibility is that don't, you'll go mad. This guy looks terribly familiar. Shiograth? Is that you? <laughs> You're a loony. Eccentric. Uh, this guy, if if he, he if his name tag wouldn't be Theodor Go, uh, Golash, I'd say he's uh, he belongs in the loony bin. And uh, that he's Shiograth. The face, the posture, uh, the, how he talks back. Oh, the abyss. Okay, the abyss. How do I visit these, this abyss? Abyss has been unlocked. Oh, uh, so this is a new game mode. Uh, so you go into the abyss and there's like endless levels and you just go deeper and deeper and deeper until you die, I think. Um, yeah. What's he telling me? That I can uh, further modify my... My Iron Maiden. Oh, that's awesome. So we can... Uh, we can re-sculpt a body, uh, apply some more makeup. Oh, he knows I'm a blade. Hush, hush, never mind. <laughs> Bunch of killjoys at all more, yeah. I agree that. Ah, he knows what started the fire and what's the, what was the cause exactly. But he won't tell us, because uh, we need to finish the main quest storyline and find out ourselves. Well, that was pretty fun. I'd say. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, I'll see you guys on the next episode. Cheers!